I'm meteorologist Adam Stiles. Gorgeous afternoon, gorgeous evening here across the GTA. Sunshine and more to be had as we go into the day tomorrow. In fact, high pressure's locked in, and that's what's going to give us the severe clear mode that we are in. Most of the day tomorrow, at least, into the afternoon, we'll start to see a couple of clouds moving through with this system that's on the way, producing some thunderstorms into southern portions of Minnesota. We may see an isolated thunderstorm as we head into the morning tomorrow until about midday. And then as we go into the afternoon, it should start to clear out there. And again, we're talking Thursday, not tomorrow at all. Going to be in pretty great shape as we head into the day on Wednesday. So take a look at the Futurecast model. We'll roll it out into the afternoon on Wednesday. Skies are clear. A couple of pop-up little cumulus clouds down to our south may squeeze out an isolated shower in the Niagara region. And then we'll get that cloud cover moving in as we go into the afternoon. Then the wet weather starts to settle in for the morning commute. On Thursday, that's when we get the first wave. Second wave comes through through mid-morning, and then in the afternoon, we'll get that cold front swinging through the area, and that cold front is going to usher in some of those colder northwesterly winds back in behind it. That's going to set us up for a cooler day as we head into Friday. So as far as that wet weather is concerned, it is going to be morning until mid-afternoon, about 3 to 6 millimeters expected with the possibility of isolated thunderstorms. Tomorrow morning, though, sunshine and 10 degrees at 8 a.m. By midday, we're up to 19. In the afternoon, we'll hit our high of 21 with those clouds starting to move into the area. Looks like a pretty nice afternoon again across the GTA. Pretty nice evening as well. As I mentioned, maybe the best opportunity to catch a peek at those cherry blossoms because we're going to see some of the uh, petals getting knocked down with the wet weather on Thursday and the wind once we get into Friday. It's a cool day, only a high of 10 in the forecast. Saturday looks to be wet and stormy. 14 degrees and then warming up as we get into the first part of next week and we'll work in some sunshine as well for the second half of the weekend.